good day. The state television company Western Armenia represent the most important news for today, today's broadcast. On the eve of the Independence Day, the 11th issue of Western Armenian magazine was published. France mobilization on the refugees of Artsakh, ambassador of France. The next meeting of Yerevan and Baku, the Turkish armed forces struck the Syrian army. The data of citizens are forcibly displaced from Artsakh were registered. Shooter Elmira Karapetian won a silver medal. January 19, 2024 is celebrated the 104th anniversary of the de facto recognition of the state Armenia in the territory of Western Armenia. On the eve of the Independence Day, Western Armenian TV will introduce you with Western Armenia and its symbols. The 11th issue of Western Armenia magazine was published. In the new issue, you can read the report of the President of Western Armenia, who presented the works done in 2023. In the new number of the magazine, it is mentioned that the historical Armenian Church of St. Astvatazin in, in Germush village of Edessa is in danger of disappearing completely. Armenian, English and French versions of the magazine are available at Western Armenian TV. The French ambassador Oliver de Cogniti was present at the French-Armenian Blue Cross charity concert at the Gavel Concert Hall in Paris. This was reported by the Embassy of Eastern Armenia in France. France mobilization for the refugees of Artsakh is not weakening. This journey through thousand-year-old Armenian music proves that it is impossible to erase Armenian people and their culture, wrote de Cogniti. The next meeting of the commissions on the border delimited will take place at the end of January. Deputy Prime Minister of Eastern Armenian Mayor Grikoyan noted that the day, time and the place should be additionally agreed upon. Grikoyan informed that according to the preliminary arrangements, the meeting will be first discussed the draft regulation on the joint activities of the commissions. Turkish military drones targeted the Syrian army in the Kamishli countryside. It is stated that the armed drones of the Turkish armed forces have targeted the positions belonging to the Syrian army. According to the Syrian independent news agency, North Press, the drone of the Turkish armed forces targeted the position belonging to the Syrian army in the village of Diben, which is located four kilometers to the southern of Kamishli. The data of 100,000 citizens forcibly displaced from Artsakh were listed, reports Armel Ghazajan, head of the Migration and C Citizenship Service. According to him, assistance was given in 112,000 citizens. The official explained the consistency of numbers of the fact that the, since October 5, the registration of forcibly displaced people was carried out not only at the border. That is why some dishonest people have been registered as well, without any forced deportation. Data were subsequently filtered. The process still continues. The members of the shooting team of Eastern Armenia continued their successful participations at the Grand Prix International Tournament. In the women's competition of 10 air pistol, Elmira Karapetian reached the final round and took the second place and became the silver medalist of the championship. This was all for today. Goodbye. Good pump, good